I didn't see you there. Hi, my name is Morgan Harrison, and I am the vacation swing at The Great Gatsby, and I'm so excited to take you on a roaring good time today during this two-show day, so let's get to it. Cheers, old sport. Hey, friends. Okay, so I'm currently walking to the theater, and I'm actually debuting a new track today, which is so exciting. Um, but I want to know what y'all want to see, who you want to see, why you want to see. So drop all those questions below. All right, we are at the theater, matcha in hand, hashtag swing nation, let's go. My girl. We're going to try this one one more time. Literally, that I feel like was like the definition of swing nation. Um, for those of you who don't know what a vacation swing is, um, so I am here... Um, not necessarily all the time, but whenever um, they need extra coverage, especially when vacations come about and people start taking um, a week off or if you have a couple personal days in a row, my job is to be here to um, add some coverage. So how I stay organized is bah, 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 bah. <laughs> um, it is flashcards. What a thrill. Um, so I literally like write down and I like color coordinate them because that's just who I am. Um, and so I have like all different colored flashcards for everybody. So today, since I'm Tanari for the first time, oh yeah, two birds, one stone. I'm debuting as Tanari today. Woo! Um, so yeah, I have like little note cards and I literally write down like bullet points of like every number and like what I need to know in that number, quick changes, all that fun stuff. Okay, the most annoying person is this person right here that's pointing at me. This guy. This person right this guy, here. This, this person's right here. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> This is Curtis, one of our amazing tap dancers. Okay, so the question is, the tap dancers are beyond amazing. Thank what was their training to get to this level? My dad actually owned a dance studio and taught me how to tap dance from the age of three. Wait, stop, I love that so much. He's the best. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Okay, just finished dinner, got a little dessert. If anyone's ever been to Holy Cream, literally some of my favorite ice cream in the city, bar none. Um, I got a little midnight Oreo with some marshmallow drizzle. Say less. Um, but in terms of coffee tea, um, I do not drink coffee. So I am a matcha and chai girl through and through. Um, and there's so many good places to choose from. But I think the ones that I've been going to the most frequently recently um are ground central um gastro market and plant shed they to me make some of the best matchas um so yeah that those are my those are my go-to matcha places for before <laughs> during and after the show <laughs> Oh my gosh. Hi. I found Dan. Yes, I'm here. Okay, so who in the cast would win the Hunger Games? Oh, snap. Who in the cast would win the Hunger Games? Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. <laughs> this is going to take a second. Hold on. In, in The Great Gatsby, I think Jordan would probably win the Hunger Games. Hands down. In Good the evening, everyone. 
everyone, this is your half hour call. Half hour, please. If you have not signed in, please do so at this time. For this evening's performance, well, it's kind of the same as the afternoon. Dan Rosales will be on as Nick. Alex will be on for Mr. McKee and bystander number two. Who Ray would win the Hunger Games? Who would win the Hunger Games? Kurt Wait. will be on for Ray. Kurt's on we were thinking that maybe it's Jackie either... Pat. Morgan is Maybe on Katie? Katie Weber. I think Katie, Katie Weber, Weber would, win the would kick some ass. <laughs> Absolutely. 100%. She would, hands down, I think. She would, like, get every <laughs> weapon. <laughs> She'd throw down. <laughs> She'd throw down. <laughs> Dariana, give me your fiercest eight count. A five, six, seven, eight. The divorce papers. I ate them. And they tasted real good. I had them with ketchup. Wow, 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 wow. So good. <laughs> I got this one ready. Ready? Go. Jeremy. Good! <laughs> Nailed it! Nailed it! <laughs> They're cute! I don't believe you. Look at my hair. Are you obsessed? Yeah, I'm obsessed. Little, little, little girl. Yeah. No, but not. Uh, uh, but like this with my fucking lips. But very cute. Yeah, I love it. <laughs> I can't! <laughs> Kayla, are you seeing this? Seeing what? Seeing what? Hey, Mariah. Hi. Um, so, who would make you break character on stage? Curtis Holland. <laughs> Curtis Holland. Period. Curtis yeah. Holland. <laughs> okay, you guys, two show day is done. Track debuted. Three down, four more to go. Excitement. Um, but I thought this question would be a perfect one to kind of wrap the whole day up. How do I stay motivated throughout Nate Show Week? Hands down, it's the people. Literally, this company, every single department, is some of the kindest, most loving group of people I've ever worked with. Um, and they are such a family and really keep each other um, together. I'm running across the street, ah! Um, and they really, you know, just hold each other accountable, hold each other up, make sure that we're all, you know, locked in with each other and it's just yeah it's a really magical place to work and i'm so so grateful and that's what keeps me motivated okay guys the time has come it is the end of my takeover um and i just wanted to say thank you so much for following along literally today was an absolute blast um i had so much fun feel free to follow me on instagram at momo and nyc Ooh, come on lighting <laughs> subway let's go um and yeah enjoy the rest of your night Mwah.